240 kilometers north of Tokyo lies the vast terrain of Fukushima, the third largest prefecture in Japan and a land blessed by Mother Nature. Its remarkable recovery from the 2011 Great East Japan earthquake comes down to its people. Three foreigners living in Japan embark on a journey of exploration. Go Fukushima! Magical Journey Fukushima. A new leaf, a new day. The theme is water. And the iconic Lake Inawashiro is an essential part of Fukushima's agricultural industry. Our travelers visit a local farm said to grow miraculous vegetables. Konnichiwa. Suzuki Koichi-san is the third generation in his family to run this farm. He grows vegetables best suited to the soil and climate of Koriyama, producing quality crops favored by many local restaurants. Wow. Oh, look, that's huge. Oh, amazing. OK, thank you so much. So, Oh, mm. it's really sweet. Mm. It is so juicy. It's an original flavor. They tested their crops and the soil in their fields for any radioactivity, posting the results on a public website to and improve their relationship with consumers. Oh, kind of is oh. like ice cream. <laughs> it's so sweet. Fukushima's miraculous vegetables have not only touched the hearts of people in Japan, but also of those abroad. Chun-san. Oh, konnichiwa. 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 <laughs> Chung hyun suk sang came to Japan from South Korea almost 40 years ago and runs a Korean restaurant using Fukushima's vegetables in all her recipes. <laughs> Wow. Mm. And it's basically the best Korean food I've had in this country. This is so good. Mm -hmm. Returning to the theme of water, our travelers head towards the ocean and arrive at a fishing harbor in the city of Iwaki. Oh, they got some friends. Okay, we're in the way. Yeah, watch out. Numanouji is now a bustling and thriving fish market. But immediately after the 2011 earthquake, the local fishermen were barred from plying their trade. To remain productive, they removed debris floating in the waters and wreckage that had sunk to the ocean floor. Because of the fishermen's unwavering commitment, the fish market was officially reopened in 2017. Every species of fish caught in Iwaki is sent to the testing center at Onahama port. The samples go into the testing room, and the results appear on the computer screen after the instrument completes its analysis. Oh, yeah. Yay. Japan has one of the strictest guidelines for radioactivity worldwide. But the guidelines in Fukushima are even more so. Our travelers get to taste Iwaki's fresh fish. This looks absolutely spectacular. It is. For everything. <laughs> oh, kamatoro. And I've never seen so fresh and beautiful like this. One of the things I really love about Japan is nobody knows, like the Japanese people do, and particularly the people of Fukushima, how to take a setback and turn it into something better. This fish market, as an example, not only have they come back to where they were before, they're better than that. Magical Journey Fukushima. A new leaf, a new day.